three and a half years since they began operating, Rhino Max at Maroochydore on the Sunshine Coast has become famous for its off-road camper trailers. Its hard floor warrior won Camper Trailer Australia's Camper of the Year last year. And now they've added another dimension to the range, the hybrid pop-top Discovery. What makes the Discovery different to a lot of the other campers is these walls, which are 30 millimetre thick fibreglass inside and out. And they are first glued and then additionally held together by this aluminium eco-skeletal frame. The Discovery can be configured to your choice of layouts, whether for indoor or outdoor dining. For example, you have this big kitchen. It slides out, three burner, cooktop, big sink, storage, and another big pantry that slides out from above. Look at that storage space. And room in here for a big fridge freezer up to 80 litres in capacity. This outdoor shower is a beauty. In fact, uh, without naming names, it's been copied by a few people on the market. First of all, it pops up on its own with springs, zips down, and you have, in seconds, you have a fully enclosed outdoor shower or private toilet compartment, if you wish. There's lots of excellent stone protection up front on the Discovery, from this vertically mounted spare wheel to the stainless steel framed rock mesh here. And then there's the checker plate toolbox here, which is really large and can hold a, a great deal of stuff from hoses to cables, etc. Inside, the Rhinomax Discovery has a familiar look about it, uh, much as you'd expect from a four and a half metre by two metre box, hybrid box. Uh, North-south bed up front, central dinette, and then either kitchen or other cupboards and fridge and things down the back. Where Rhinomax has made a difference inside the Discovery is in the number of little storage drawers they've found in places that otherwise would go spare. For example, inside the bed, four separate little storage hatches. Uh, on the bench in the other end, you've got a huge nest of drawers all running on roller bearings with stainless steel liners and at the bottom a full width drawer that you can put quite long items in taking full advantage of the cutaway rear end and that space which would normally be lost. There are lots of other little things that make the Discovery really livable. For example, huge headroom, windows, four of them all around the pop top, let the outdoor in and when it's night, a strip of LEDs that goes all the way around sheds its light on the roof, fills the whole interior with nice muted light. And the other feature of this is because they make their own suspension, they can fit the wheels and tyres of your choice and create the offset that you need to follow the wheel tracks of your four wheel drive. I'm really impressed with the, uh, the Rhinomax Discovery. It has a lot of the features of many of the more expensive hybrid pop top camper trailers all rolled together in one at a very competitive price of around 65,000 as you see this particular unit. Add an ensuite, indoor cooking, an indoor fridge and other items and you're still going to have a lot of change out of 80,000, probably closer to 75. For the quality of this unit, the way it's built, put together, it's off-road suspension, I think it's excellent value for money. You can read all about the next issue of Camper Trailer Australia magazine. Thank you.